Am I the asshole? For telling off a customer at work for her autistic son's stim. I work at a grocery store as a cashier. Over the summer I was temporarily located to the garden department in the parking lot, which I've been doing every year for three-ish years. We have a regular whose son 68 has autism. Apparently one of his stims is spraying bottles. Like the cleaning kind. I didn't know this until this incident. Our setup for the garden area till is kind of a U or C shape. We have a cart with the till so it can be taken inside overnight, and two tables bolted together. One table has a shelf underneath where we keep various paper towels and cleaning stuff including a bottle of diluted bleach, as well as bags for customers buying non-plant items, pots that customers have brought back for recycling, garden gloves for the employees, etc. Around the whole thing is a table skirt that's attached to the table. I really have no say in the setup beyond moving things around on the shelf. Anyway, one day this mom brought her kid in. I saw him trying to reach around the table legs to the cleaning supplies, so I moved them down the shelf closer to me and told him those bottles are for cleaning, not for touching and asked him to please leave them alone. Then I got started scanning his mom's stuff. Out of nowhere, a bunch of droplets hit my sunglasses and cheeks. I looked up and the kid had pulled the table skirt which was zip tied tightly to the table away, stuck his arm through, grabbed the bottle of bleach, and started spraying it around. I quickly grabbed it from him as his mom laughed and reminded me he's autistic and said he has a spray bottle of water at home that he likes to spray people with. This is where I might be ta. I told her that first off, she shouldn't be encouraging him to spray people with anything without their consent, and second, that wasn't water, it was bleach, and they were both lucky I was wearing sunglasses because I could have gone blind. She was really offended and again tried to tell me he was autistic. I said that may be an excuse for him to not realize, but she needs to be paying closer attention to her kid in public places if he's going to do stuff like that. She hasn't brought her kid in since. I feel bad because he was a nice kid and I don't know how much help she has at home, but I still feel like what I said was true. Am I the asshole? For telling off the mom of an autistic child and prompting her to stop bringing him back. Not the asshole. You put the blame squarely on her, which is where it should be. Her son is a lawsuit waiting to happen. She should thank you for the reality check. Autistic mom of an autistic kiddo here. You are not the asshole. Stims serve an important purpose in our lives but there are limits and this is so far beyond what is acceptable and understandable. That mom is also not doing her child any favors by not educating him on when and where it's okay to spray bottles i.e. only at home and or where you know for a fact that what's in it is safe, or one day it'll be his own eyes he sprays with bleach. Not the asshole she is responsible for monitoring her son and his actions. Autism is not an excuse for her failures as a parent. Not the asshole. If the stim was annoying you would be TA, but bleach in the face can cause blindness, skin burns, and at the very least destroy clothing. It can also ruin hair. If she can't control dangerous stimming, then she either needs CPS or an assistant. This isn't shaking a hand or bobbing their head stimming this is assault with a chemical agent. If you do see them again, suggest she get the assistance she needs. It's not easy raising Spectrum kids, but that doesn't excuse what he did. Not the asshole. This wasn't an annoying stim I thought stims were a form of self-soothing and not a free pass to do anything including using stuff that doesn't belong to the person. You could have been blinded or seriously injured if the spray had hit your face. This was dangerous intrusive behavior and the parent needs to control it. By her attitude it appears she is not even attempting to modify behavior. Not the asshole. She may not have been able to prevent his impulse, but laughing it off afterwards was totally inappropriate. That's oh shit, sorry honey, we've talked about this scenario. Not the asshole. At home, that's fine. Do whatever you want. It's your problem what your child does. In public though, 
people are allowed to get upset that your kid is spraying them regardless of the reason that they're doing it. Not the asshole. You tried to correct him once W.O. overstepping and at that point she should have been more mindful of him. He could have gotten hurt or hurt you. Not the asshole. Mother needs to control her kid. Not make excuses. Not the asshole. Being autistic is not free license to do whatever, especially when it may endanger others. That said, move the bottle somewhere kids autistic or otherwise can't get to it. Natar. This reminds me when I was working in retail. A kid slapped by butt. The mom was just like it's okay he has autism. I was like it's not okay it's sexual harassment. I ended up getting talked to because I made a customer upset. When I told my manager what happened she told me I was in the wrong and need to learn to deal. Not the asshole. The kid is one bottle spray away from spritzing the wrong person. Not the asshole. The kid is autistic she isn't. She needs to learn how to parent her kid. Not the asshole as with any child, responsibility for his actions falls on the parent or caretaker, especially since his autism further reduces his ability to identify acceptable behavior. You were correct to call her out on it, she needs to be proactive in ensuring he doesn't get a hold of chemical spray bottles, not dismiss a nearly serious incident just because that's how he is. Nope not the asshole. Thank God your eyes were okay. You focused on what the mom was failing to do, not the son's stim, not the asshole. Not the asshole you can judge harmful stims. They can be controlled or redirected in a lot of autistic people, and if they can't they have no business being in public potentially hurting people. Autism is not an excuse for being an asshole. Honestly, I don't know if that's even a stim. Kid might just be a little shit because his mother never corrects him. I would get playing with a spray bottle on his own as a stim, but not spraying other people with it. Not the asshole as you said the kid could have seriously done some damage if the bleach got in your eyes. People need to really learn to control their kids or leave them at home. Not the asshole. She needs to realize that she's liable for her son hurting people, even though he has autism. Not the asshole if he has to have a spray bottle she needs to have an empty one for him to pretend to spray. WTF is wrong with her? Not the asshole. Not the asshole. You were absolutely correct on every point you made. It'd be one thing if he was stimming by spraying water at inanimate objects. However, autism isn't an excuse to spray someone with two bleach into someone's face. If I was the mother, I wouldn't discourage the stim. However, I'd be teaching him when where it's not appropriate to spray water. Not the asshole. If this woman thinks it's okay for her autistic child to spray bleach in people's eyes, and fails to supervise him to the extent that she makes it possible for him to do so, then it's good she's no longer bringing him to a store that's stocked with spray bottles of bleach which, especially after this incident, you should be keeping someplace much safer. You did nothing wrong. Not the asshole. Nadar. Being autistic doesn't mean he can't learn what he can and can't do. His mother is not cool, 